Hey, uh, if you're watching this, you watch this because, uh, you want to see this dinosaur egg. I bought this at the fair, and this is a exact replica of a pterodactyl egg. Well, that's at least what they said. Um, I'm hoping it is. They, uh, made it hollow. I think it's made out of clay. But, um, it's pretty cool because, uh, if if they uh, are true to the word and this is an exact replica of a uh, pterodactyl egg, then um, I can tell my friends that I have a uh, exact replica of a pterodactyl egg. How many people can say that? Well, uh, I want to make a video about that, and I also want to make a video about my ostrich eggs. Two of them. I uh. Bought this. Wait, no. I uh, recently went to California, and uh, I know. Uh, why would you go so to California just to get an ostrich egg? I uh, didn't go there just to get an ostrich egg, but I went there and they had ostrich eggs, so I was able to uh, keep this on the plane without it cracking, which is a uh, pretty good because it had to be in my luggage because it had more than like three ounces of liquid in it. This one was full. No, wait. This one was full. This one I bought empty. Uh, I know this this one was the one that was full because it's got two holes in it. And I blew that egg out myself and then we ate it. And uh, it was pretty good, but I'm not sure if they are true to the word about saying it was a pterodactyl egg. Because um, that's the size of the pterodactyl egg that they say is an exact replica. And that's the size of a, uh, of a, uh, ostrich egg. So, unless an ostrich egg is two times bigger than a pterodactyl egg, then, um, they're probably pulling my chain there, but, uh, there's no definite, uh, facts against it, so I'm just going to say this is a exact replica of a dinosaur egg. So, uh, that's pretty cool. I just wanted to make this video about that. And, uh, peace.